Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 3 Blind with me, Missy May. This is episode four. Um, yeah, the game crashed a minute ago. I was starting to record this and the game Very happy music. Yes, that's that's the response I would expect to me announcing that the game had crashed. Um, I'm gonna take lots of speech. Oh, wow. Not that much speech. And some sneaking. And this might be wrong, but um, I'm, I'm doing it. This is what we're doing. Okay, I did read these. Um, it was like right after I did this that the game crashed. So I, I did read these. This gives you more damage against dudes because we're a chick. So more damage against dudes. And special um, dialogue options with dudes, which I like. Daddy's girl is science and medicine, you know, because dad's a scientist and a medic. Okay, gun nut is small guns and repair. Uh, this gives us a point for special. I don't know about that. I don't know if this means, if it's good. I don't know how special the special is. I don't know. Maybe this would be like a really meta thing to have, but I'm not a very meta person. Um, we're just doing this for fun, you guys. Okay. Little leaguer. Melee weapons, an explosive, swift learner, and thief is for lockpicks and sneak. I like swift learner because I feel like the earlier in the game we take this perk, the bigger payoff we're going to get. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to take this. And, um, yeah, the game had just straight up crashed on me, so I'm sorry about that. But this time, maybe it won't. Let's uh, take a look at our character. I did uh, edit her a little bit. She looks a little different now. She's still not going to win any beauty contests. Okay, these are the DLC, aren't they? Yeah, she's not winning any beauty contests, but yeah, that's us. It's not not great, but I mean, what can I do with the uh, the tools on hand? She kind of looks like a fish, but that's okay. Alright. So I'm just going to wait for all of these DLC things to pop up. Mothership Zeta. A new radio broadcast has been heard across the capital wastelands. While completely unintelligible, it sounds ominous. That sounds fun. Oh, cool. Our level cap has increased. I didn't even know there was a level cap, but that's good. Come on. Is that it? That might be it. Okay. Let's look at our uh, quest. Right, those are the ones we just got. Okay, following us, this, this is our daddy quest. Okay, so it looks pretty far away on this map. It doesn't look very far here. Um, should we just go straight there? I kind of want to look around a little bit, but I'm a, actually, I'm a little bit scared the game's going to crash again. Oh, wait, what is this? Distress call, okay. Um, I am a little bit afraid the game's going to crash again, so I would like to go to uh, where we're supposed to go to make sure and get a nice save there before um, we continue on. Yeah, this is going to have us go to Megaton. Uh, they mentioned, the Overseer mentioned it. Whoa, whoa, what? What? Is that the water? Oh, that scared me. Okay, um, he said that there was a couple people who were part of, like, the search teams who, um, stayed behind outside as ambassadors so let's go find those people what were their names like was one of them agnes or something um i'm sure you know but i don't know so oh 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 oh, 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 oh no oh, 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 oh oh sorry freaking terrifying let's use our special system Sorry, dog. You're just, like, absolutely horrible. No. 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 Sorry. Dog. Uh, I just don't with that. Just, no. Okay. Oh, man. We're actually really low on health. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's... Hmm. Okay. Oh, aid. Okay. Rads and HP. Damage resistance. Personality and intellect. 
Rad's in HP. Uh, wow, we're missing a lot. So we, let's just use a stem pack. Uh, let's use another two stim packs. I just want us to be healthy because I don't know what what I don't know what's going on. So better safe than sorry. So so this is uh, something. This is this is it. It seems is this a wall? It's a very terrible wall that they have there. But okay. What is that? It's near the town, so it's friendly, right? Oh, uh, let's get a quick save in, because... What? What is that sound? Oh, okay, it's the, like, the freaking gate. Yeah, that's me, IRL. I identify with you. I don't know who you are, but yes. Hello. Crow, who are welcome, you? Welcome, welcome. My name is Crow, and I travel the land offering vestments of protection. And you are fortunate I found you in time. You don't look like you're very protected you bear yourself. The look okay, there of you go. one who is haunted. But I am proud to say that my wares can protect you from even the cruel claws of death itself. I'm not really believing this child. Trade caravan. Okay. My caravan sells clothing and armor to decorate and protect the body while it endures the ravages of the physical world. Okay. My travels take me from Canterbury Commons to where there is true need of this protection. After all, this is what they'll pay the most for. Okay, well, here's the thing. If the clothes make the man, then here are the means to remake yourself. We have, like, no money, so I'm not... Can we sell him this? Okay. Okay. Um... I don't... This maybe. This is gonna get us a little bit of money. I hope I don't need any of this. I'll just sell this. I don't need it. I oh melee weapon. I'm gonna keep that then. I'm gonna put that on so I can bash things with our baseball bat until we figure out what's going on more. Okay. That's good. I'm good with that. What is he? That gives us enough money for stuff we don't even need. Look at that. That sounds nice. A radiation suit. We'll probably need that. Stim packs. Settler Marauder. Uh, I don't know, guys. What do you think? Should we get a... Should we get a radiation suit? Weighs five pounds, but we, we, I mean... Yeah, let's do it. I don't know... Yeah, okay. Thank you. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Oh, Maybe. he repairs things. Let's, let's, see what, let's see what he can... Let's see what he can do. Um... Shouldn't he have, like, repaired this thing before he sold it to me? Wouldn't that have been nice? Okay. Well, we don't have very many caps, and I didn't actually entirely mean to click that, so we're just gonna say goodbye to our new friend, Walk bro. Well, friend. Bye, buddy. Good luck out there. Okay, these are the giant ants the Overseer's Notes mentioned, and this is... a mistake. Okay, good. Oh, I like him. Please stand clear of the gate. He's cute. He's a little friendly robot man. Hello. Need some grub? Have yourself a nice visit, partner. Oh, thank you. You have yourself a nice standing outside, partner. Okay. Beautiful. Let's go in here. Oh my, that does not look good. Did you see that? Did you see that loading that screen? <laughs> you don't know that for sure. Oh, wait. <laughs> I guess he does know that. Name's Lucas Sims, Hello. town sheriff, and mayor too, when the need arises. Okay. I don't know why, 
But I like you, girl. I like you, too. Something tells me you're all right. Yay. So welcome to Megaton. Just holla if you need something. That's nice. He's friendly. Uh... Nice. We're not gonna. We're not gonna be mean to this nice fella. Okay. Nice town you have here, Sheriff. It's a pleasure to meet you. Friendly and well mannered. I think we're gonna get along just fine. Oh, we're gonna get along you with some guys. You treat my people nice, and you're welcome to stay as long as you'd like. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Uh oh, was that a uh, threat? It was, wasn't it? All right. Message received. I'm glad we understand each other. Now, is there something I can help you with? Looking for my dad. Oh, look, that's actually one of the options. Looking for my father, middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him. I could use some directions. Let's discuss this bomb. What bomb? Do I have a bomb? I feel like that's a threat. Like, like you just <laughs> you just hold up a bomb. You're like, let's just... No, um, we're not a suicide bomber. Okay. Know anything about the area outside Megaton? Tell me about your town. Let's just ask about dad first. Nope. Sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. Okay. I'd ask around town. Okay, that's fair. Uh, how about you tell us about the town then? What do you want to know? Oh, wow. It's more options. Uh, why is it called uh, Megaton? Does it have a doctor? Where can I get a drink? Let's, uh, why is it called uh, Megaton? The town's named after the bomb that's sitting in the middle of it. It hasn't gone off. Yes. That doesn't sound like a very good place to build a town. Don't you think someone wants to disarm the thing? Is it not already disarmed? What kind of crazy people build a... Whatever. Okay. Who would build a town around a bomb that's crazy? Yeah. Literally this. One day that thing's gonna go off. You're living on borrowed time. This also. Who would build a town around a bomb that's crazy? Um. Don't you think someone should disarm that thing? I don't know. None of these are bad choices. Um, who would build a town around a bomb? That's crazy. It's not like the place was put up overnight. Megaton's been here for decades. Been growing and growing ever since. Started out as a small settlement of people trying to get into Vault 101. When they were denied, they stuck around here. Well, that's fine, but why would you Some stick around the bomb? Some of them started worshiping the thing like a god. Now we've got a whole goddamn church. They're nuts, no doubt. But mostly harmless. Um, not really. By now, most people don't give a shit. They figure if it ain't gone off by now, it never will. No. I respectfully disagree. Yeah. Um. Oh, I can see about... We can't... Oh, we can't... Can we disarm this and, like, help him? Is this, like, a side quest? Whatever, I don't plan on sticking around if that bomb ever explodes. Oh, this is so mean. Um. Okay, I don't actually know how to disarm it. Maybe there's, a, there's something we can do. Oh, all right. Fine. But listen here. Just take a look at it first. Go easy. Okay. If you get the job done, there'll be 100 caps in it for you. Money! Oh, wow. We only have a 35% chance on that. Oh, gosh. I want to click it, though. What if he gets mad? I don't need a reward. I couldn't sleep at night knowing you could all die. That's like saintly. Are we a saint? I mean, we're a nice person, but are we actually a saint? I'm not, I'm not sure. I haven't thought about to what degree of nice we want to be. I just don't want to be mean. A hundred caps. All right, I'll take a look. No, my problem. Good luck, Sheriff. Okay, let's, let's try it. Can you, uh, can you give us more money? Not an option, I'm afraid. Okay. We aren't exactly rolling in cash down here. That's all right. We failed. That's fine. All right, I'll take, I'll take a, a look at it. Okay, I'll take a look at it. Great. Go ahead and see what you can do. Just be careful. Okay. I feel like this is a very bad idea. Okay, know anything about the area outside Megaton? It's called the Wasteland for a reason. But there are settlements, too, spread all around. The human race is stubborn like that. Okay. To the south, you've got Rivet City. But don't bother going to D.C. The place is a war zone. Something tells me we're going to be going to D.C. Uh, I mean, I just asked him about my dad. I don't think he would have anything new to say. Use some directions sure around thing, town. Partner. What do you need to find? Uh, how about a 
general store. Moira sells all kinds of stuff at her place. Trader side supply. Take a guess where it is. <laughs> okay, how about the clinic? Our clinic is down in the crater, by the bomb. Doc Church is a little rough around the edges, but the man's got talent and compassion. Okay. Weapons? You'll probably want to see Moira at Crater Side Supply. That's the general good person. She sells person. some weapons. Make some, too, from what I hear. Okay. Her place is down by the crater. Okay. How about a bar? Sure is. Moriorty's. The entrance is on the top level, opposite the main gate. Okay. Just be careful. Moriarty is not your friend, no oh. matter what he may say. So don't fall for his lies. And for God's sake, don't trust the man. Okay, there's a little bit of drama going on in the town. Is it bad that I already trust the like the nice sheriff more than I'm probably going to trust that guy who I haven't even met? Uh, maybe they just don't like each other. Okay, what about beds? Up at Moriarty's at the south end of town. Same place. Talk okay. to Nova. She'll help you out. Okay. Let's talk about something sure else. Thing. What's on your mind? I don't think he has anything new to say about Dad, but I'm going to ask him anyway. Well, come to think of it, I do remember a stranger coming through here. Oh, really? Had a look in his eye. You know the kind a man gets when he's got a purpose. Oh. Spend some time up in the saloon. Might want to check with Moriarty. Just watch yourself. That man's trouble. Okay, so we have to go through like a... Crazy guy to find Dad. Okay, I have to go now. Don't blow us up now. Uh, yeah, that's uh, no promises about that. Okay, I obviously see the bomb. It's kind of hard to miss this. Hello. You're no one in special. You don't even have a proper name. Hello. I see you have a nice Brahmin. Uh, it's just a mistake. It's a mistake, Cal. Okay. Hello. Now I know I've never seen you in Megaton before. That's true. Yes, just passing through, right? We get people trying to settle down here all the time. Anyway, if you're hungry, you came to the right place. What can I get you? Um, can you tell me about Megaton? Some people hate this place, but I guess that's their right. What the hell do they want out of life? Food, shelter, and safety. Works for me. Okay. Um, what's the word around town? I ain't heard much, truth be told. I don't really ever leave the lantern. Too much work. Too few hours in the day, you know? Mm-hmm. What's on the menu? Hey, I won't say it's all fresh, but it'll keep you going. Okay, so she's a vendor and she sells... Food. Do we need food? We don't have any money to buy food. I'm sure we can find some food. Uh, okay, bye. Remember us if you need something. Okay. Let those who dwell here in his favored land so this is now to the, the church of the of Adam. that he was talking Come about. I'm scared to go near this the thing. Of the globe, for this <gasps> oh, I'm not going to activate that. That's absolutely terrifying. It is the very symbol of Adam's glory. Um, Let it serve as a reminder of the division that has occurred in the past and the resplendence of the promise of our division in the Who times to come. No one. This Give place is freaky. To Adam, my friend. Oh wow, Release that's like Chinese. His power, feel his glow, and be divided. Um, let's just talk Who to this guy. Could it be a new addition to our humble little community? This poor guy. Dear child, Welcome. I feel like he has some Welcome to Megaton. Some problems. I am Confessor Cromwell, prophet of Atom and father of the undying glow. Please, child, come to the church anytime. Okay. Anytime at all. Uh sure, tell me about the Church of Adam. Yes. What would you like to know? Oh, it's gonna give us more options. Um <laughs> <laughs> uh, what is wrong with you people? No. Uh, what do you believe? The Church of the Children of Atom is based on the idea that each single atomic mass in all of creation contains within it an entire universe. When that atomic mass is split, 
a single universe divides and becomes two, thus signifying the single greatest act of Atom's creation. I don't really understand. Occasionally, a divine event occurs, and trillions upon trillions of new universes are created. The last such event took place here, 200 years ago. Okay. Where most of the lost children of Atom see that event as simple war and devastation, we see creation and unification in Atom's glow. Well, hey, whatever helps them cope with being in uh, this, this terrible place, that's fine. Uh, why do you Those worship Those who bomb? were called to Atom during the Great Division were very fortunate. They were permitted to aid in the process of Atom's creation. We seek the same, both in symbol and in fact. And the bomb, as you call it, represents Atom's capacity for creation. We kneel before it and ask that Atom call us to aid him. We pray that out of our meager bodies, he will create new life. All right, well... Let's talk about I something wish. else. Um, have you ever traveled outside Megaton? In my youth, I traveled quite a bit, but that was a different life. I assume that you are seeking information and advice, yes? I'm not really sure this guy has any the good advice. The only advice that I can offer is this. You will find no wealth in the wasteland greater than that which you will find within yourself. Okay. Bask in Atom's glow, and you will understand. Uh... Alright, what's the news? News? My friend, I take effort not to be involved in such worldly business. Earthly pursuits distract from Atom. Okay. Of course. Now that you mentioned it, I've noticed that Moira has hired a mercenary to protect her goods. The man never sleeps, so they say. Okay. Um. What can you tell me about Megaton? Megaton, Atom's sacred village. He has chosen this place for the site of his shrine, and we have been called. Outsiders ask us, why did you build a town around a bomb? To them I say, the bomb brings the promise of division hmm. and the gift of the glow. All right, well, I the guess that answers my us. question. The bomb is Atom, and thus we are Atom, awaiting the day in which each of us gives birth to a trillion new lives. Okay, these guys really like the bomb. I feel like they're going to freak the heck out if I disarmed it. Give you some directions. In our own way, we are all lost. Um, well, actually, I already... Never mind. I already know where that stuff is. Maybe later. I have to go. I wish you well on your path. Okay, so the clinic is down here. Somewhere. Is that it? Is that the clinic? Yep. There's the clinic. We found it. Um, maybe I shouldn't have used those stim packs earlier. Maybe we should have gone to the clinic, but hey! Whatever. Um, okay. All right, um, who are you? No one, okay. This is the church. Okay. Uh. Okay, it's up here. Hello. Isn't it? This is the armory. Oh, no, we're not going to break in to the armory. Are you a child? Hello, child. What's up? Oh, he's the guy's uh, kid. That's good. What is this? I don't think that belongs to me. Uh, it's a door. It doesn't... Obviously, it doesn't belong to me. Okay. So where's the... Oh, I need to be up there, don't I? Okay. All right, no big deal. That's fine. What is this, though? The women's restroom. Okay, that's good to know. 
Hello, you have a name. Hello. Well, hey there, stranger. I'm Manya. The old coot wandering around here is my husband, Nathan. Okay. If there's anything we can help you with, ask me. Don't ask Nathan. He'll just blabber at you about the damned enclave all day. Okay. Hmm. What's the road around town? There's only one thing that concerns me in this town these days. What my damn fool husband is doing. He wanders around here all day and all night, preaching about the Enclave and trying to get parts for his guns. Okay. I'm not sure who's the bigger fool, him or me. After all, I married him. I don't know, maybe he's just trying to keep you safe. I don't know what the Enclave is, but making guns is probably a really good thing to do in this society. I can tell you just about anything you want to know, honey. Megaton's history ain't no secret. Okay. What's this place made of? How did the town start? How did you get here? Where did everyone else come from? Who's in charge? What is this place made of? Long ago, before the war, they used to be machines. They were like buses. But they flew through the sky, taking people anywhere they wanted to go. Airplanes. You didn't have to walk. You just went to the air station, bought a ticket, and took to the skies. Anywhere in the world, you just up and flew there. When the war happened, the machine Sounds started pretty dropping neat whenever from the sky. Whenever she explains Everyone it like that. Everyone around here thinks that the bomb made the crater, but it didn't. The crater provided good cover from the dust storms. And when my daddy and the rest of the town decided to build the walls, they used what they had. Okay, so why didn't they move the bomb? Some of us wanted to, but the Church of Adam was just getting its start then. We needed their help to build the walls and clear the wreckage. Okay. If we'd have tried to move the bomb, they would have refused to help. Besides, a lot of people just wanted to leave it alone. It didn't seem to be hurting anything, and who knows what would happen if we messed with it. Mm hmm There are a lot of parts here for just one machine. Well, there's obviously more than one machine. I have other sure questions. Thing, well, the sheriff's probably in charge. Uh, how did you get here? I was born here, actually. Just like my pappy. Oh, for a while I helped him scavenge and then later on his caravan. But traipsing around the wasteland has worked for young people. After I met Nathan, I just wanted to stop moving around so much. We've been here ever since. Of course, I can't say that it's been good for Nathan's sanity. Well, hey, you have a husband and a life. That's good. Let's just... End it here. Well, you come on back anytime you want to hear more. Okay. I just want to get uh, a come nice... Come if you need something, honey. I like her. She's nice. I, want... I just want to get an overview of the whole kind of place before I um, before I have to end this, this uh, episode here. I guess I could explore on my own and then not have just episode after episode of me walking around talking to people. Um, let's go ahead and talk to Moriarty and then... And then next time, maybe we'll be able to find Dad. Okay. Ah, uh, traveler. Wrong, you piece of junk. Every yeah, day you it's need the something? same damn thing. I told you, Gob, it ain't the radio. The Enclave Station comes in fine. My, my. Oh. Just when I'd all but given up hope. My dear girl, I'm very happy to make your acquaintance. It's Lucy and Lachance. And Mr. Burke. And you. Well, you are not a resident of this putrescent cesspool. That makes you a rather valuable individual. I kind of like him, but I kind of don't. Uh, does... Does it? Does it? Don't you see? You're a free agent. You have no ties here, no interest in this settlement's affairs. Megaton means nothing to you. <clears throat> okay. I represent certain interests who view this town, this Megaton, as a blight on a burgeoning urban landscape. If this settlement were to go away, oh why, no, who would really care? Certainly not you or I. He wants me to blow up the town, doesn't he? Wait, you're gonna destroy the town? Your sick man, Mr. Burke. This conversation's over. I'm kind of feeling this one. I don't really know if I should burn my bridges with Mr. Burke, though. You're gonna destroy the town? No, no. I'm merely a recruiter. 
You get to have the real fun. I'm not doing this. The undetonated atomic bomb for which this town is named is still very much alive. Why would I do this? All it needs is a little motivation. He would have to give me a super huge... I have huge... in my possession a fusion pulse charge. Once rigged to the bomb, it will be detonated by you at a secure location. You'd have to give me, like, a lot of stuff to convince me to do this. Only for 500? An extra 500. No, we're not doing this. Alright, no. You're out of your mind. There's no way I'm helping you. Or this town is under my protection. You're gonna leave. Oh, man. Um... I kind of want to protect the town. I mean, I don't know anything about this place, but that one old lady was really nice. Uh, let's get him to leave. Yeah, this is under my protect. You're going to leave. These are my friends. That you're going to oh, leave. I see. I didn't realize Megaton had any guardian beyond its intrepid sheriff. Very well, then. I'll take my leave. Okay, bye. You suggest. It's Galaxy News. Their signal's been back again. Hmm? No. Now that is a disappointment. Well, if you change your mind, the offer still stands. Good day. All right. So if I had said that one, he would just stay here. But since I told him to get lost. Damn it! Goddamn radio! Now what the hell do you want? Work. Well, you're freaky, aren't you? Why? What are you talking about? I'm not doing anything. Jeez. You want something, or you just looking to get your ass beat? Uh, I just want to. I just want to talk to this guy. Actually, no. Are you a ghoul? Hello. You're a little freaky, you're a little zombie-esque. That's okay. Hello. Colin Moriarty, at your service. You're Welcome Irish. To Moriarty's. My saloon, my home, my slice of heaven in this backwoods little burg. You've got the caps, I've got your pleasure. Please sit down, make yourself comfortable. Your troubles are a thing of the past. Um, alright, well I'm actually gonna stop here and uh, next time we'll see what uh, Moriarty has to say about our dad, alright? So, look forward to it and I'll see you in the next episode.